it's Katie and welcome to my corner of the world. So today I have the June My Ireland box for you. So if you want to see what I got, come join me. Welcome. Thank you so much for spending part of your day with me. My name is Katie and on my channel I do all kinds of unboxing, subscription boxes, mystery boxes, boxes from Etsy. I also do hauls, lifestyle, beauty, clothes, food, you name it. If you shop for it, I have probably hauled it. If that sounds good to you. Please consider hitting that subscribe button down there. It is completely free and it would mean the world to me. Also, turn on the bell notification right next to it. That will let you know when I have new content that goes up. Also let you know about giveaways that are going on. Active giveaways are always down in the description. All right, so today I have the My Ireland box for you. This is a box uh, from Ireland, and it is curated in Dingle, Ireland by a woman named Catherine, K-A-T-H-A-R-I-N-E, and her husband and their small team. And now, Dingle is in the, the Lower East portion of Ireland, and on the Dingle Peninsula, uh, um, just by County Cork. All right. um, it is a $49.95 a month, and then shipping on top of that. So it does end up being about $65 a month. So it is a little pricey, but it is coming from Ireland, and it is goods that are all made in Ireland. And you can get it a little bit cheaper if you go longer, of course. There's, it's $135 there's for three months, and you get some free chocolates. I will pop a card right up there er, that will show you the freebies that I got for signing up for three months. And um, if you go for six, it's $249.75, and you get one free box. If you go for a full year, it is $499.50. You get two free boxes. Is the boxes typically ship by the 10th of each month. Now they are shipping worldwide. So uh, when your box gets there is can vary. I do know that there are people who are still waiting for April boxes from my Ireland box um, because of the shipping with the pandemic and everything. And things are a little crazy, but it uh, so far, at least on the east coast of the U.S., we've been getting them very early on in in the season, in the month. Um, and they say on there that we bring you on a journey of discovery of Ireland through Irish treasures. And you'll get Irish treats, Celtic jewelry, ceramics, accessories, these all kinds of different things. Um, Catherine does have a... Facebook page too, where she often takes walks and takes you on them and vlogs them um, of all of the beautiful Irish countryside. So it says hello from Ireland, and and it does have all of her information up here. I will put it, all of the information down in the description. And it is a very lightweight box this month. I will say last month was my first month, and I was blown away. Hey, it was, um, the theme was like the Irish farmhouse and it was exactly what you would want. It was, is, um, a mix for the Irish brown soda bread. It was tea. It was jam. It was cookbook. It was phenomenal. It was a mug. Uh, I, I could not say enough about it. I mean, I, my grandmother, I talked about, and I will again, pop that one up there. My grandmother is from Clonakelty, which is a small town in County Cork, Ireland. She was born and raised there, um, came to the United States at about 16 years old, well, married, had my mom and, and my mom's um, siblings. Things. So um, I have been privileged to be able to go back and see County Cork and Clonakilty twice so far. I hope to take my kids next year. Unfortunately, my grandmother is is long gone, but her memory lives on very strong in my mind. And I do want to pass that love of Ireland and the, my Irish heritage to my children. My husband's family is also from Ireland. His grandfather was born and raised there, just like my grandmother. So oh, um, we both have a very strong connection to Ireland. Let's go ahead and get into this. And I will show you some pictures that I have from Ireland and along the way. So this is what it looks like when I open it up. Uh, 
so the first thing we have in here is the Islands of Ireland, compiled by Catherine and Dingle, Ireland, and for my Ireland members. So it looks like a little book that is actually a, done by a Catherine, who is the curator of the box. Uh, it's all about the different and uh, islands in Ireland. And yeah, that's what it is. So it does take you through each our island. Here's is um, Garnish Island in County Cork. Eric, and it takes you kind of all along the west coast, which is pretty much where they are. Let me see if I can find. Here's the Aran Islands, and I actually did go visit the Aran Islands when I was out there. 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 Um, let me show you a picture of when I went to the Aran Islands. Whoopsie. Yeah, so this is a larger picture of the Aran Islands. So similar to the Cliffs of Moher, where you have these deep a, a drop-offs, and and you can go right up to there. there. This is actually the Cliffs of Moher, which are before you get to the Aran Islands. These are the more famous ones. And, and then this is a picture of the Aran Islands coming, the Aran Islands coming into it as we were going there. So you did have to take a boat to get out there. There, there. So let's see. Here's our note. Oh, hello to you. As I write this, the hailstorms pound against the windows in the summertime. Aim, I hear you say yes, indeed. Uh, in the summertime? Well, yes, indeed. Yes, Ireland, the weather is crazy. Um, it is kind of rainy. It doesn't get super hot, um, although it has gotten hotter with global warming and everything. And, um, compared to last year, the weather has been quite cold. We're all crossing our fingers for a warmer June, July, and August. Well, we had a, had a very cold Memorial Day weekend here in Maryland, so. Uh, we welcomed a new team member. Or, um, you have a lot to read this month in your My Ireland box, given that I've compiled a lovely but lengthy booklet on the islands of Ireland for you. So, oh, I'll keep the letters short. Her letters are usually, like, super long. And, um, and then it goes into each of the makers, and she gives you a little history of all of them. Um, so she, of course, has the book. Let's see, what else do we have in here? Her, um... Your great Blasket Island experience. So just kind of like a little bit of brochure. Or the Dingle uh, Slayhead Tours. There's, she always has um, some type of food. So this is her sister Sorcha's famous fish pie. Hey, oh, isn't this one gorgeous? Is. So, oh, oh, it says one of the surprises in this month is a tour of the magnificent Ring of Kerry that incorporates the islands off its coasts, such as Skillig Rock and the Valentina Islands, and lots more to enjoy. Your knowledgeable tour guides are local Dingle men, Calm Bambury, a who discovered the ancient rock art spiral stone that the February My Ireland box was inspired by. I didn't get the February one, so I like. I don't have that to show you. Okay, so we get a, a um, what we do is we have to go online and, and they have paid for us to watch a tour of the Ring of Kerry and the islands. Um, and it says it's a $19.50 value. So, so, oh, this is, I guess, kind of parts of the Ring of Kerry and the islands. I just love this photo. It's beautiful. Well, uh, part of the Ring of Kerry is this place called the Gap of Dunlow. These are my pictures from when I was there. Uh, now, Ireland is kind of wet, but it, it doesn't usually rain as much as it did when we were there. Here's more there of when we were there. We went on these little jaunty carts. Right, it's like this. That's my mom. Um, um, I think that's my aunt behind her there. Uh, and it was pouring rain that day. It was 
crazy and we're on these little carts and there's nowhere to go once you start off on the cart except to finish the tour all right, and you take this little cart all right, all right, that's like horse drawn and down and then you get on a little boat and go and eat and we're there with all these other European travelers who are way more prepared for the weather than us Americans are <laughs> it was crazy it was crazy hey, you can see here these like little um waterfalls or, or like rivers they don't exist when it's dry that's how hard it was raining is that you could actually see these days so those are some of my pictures and my memories from the ring of carry and the gap of dunlow from when we went and that was the first time i went it was crazy so let's see what else we have in there i i will have to let you know how the tour is is um oh so we have this little handmade puffin by red rufus handmade in ireland from pairs of socks so how cute is that you can see kind of back here all the sock details so you have a little puffin and he's cute but, um Red Rufus feature, so she's featured them before, but had a sheep. The maker of these, Christina, has been making these since 2009, in, in, and she makes them out of socks. We also have, ooh, we have some treats. We have O'Donnell's Tipperary Irish Sea Salt Salt Potato Chips. We have from Mella's Irish Butter Fudge. That sounds delicious. And then the last thing we have in here is this little puffin and key ring. How cute is he? If you can see him a little better. So you have a little tag there that says Ireland. And then you have a little puffin on the keychain. And okay, so that was my Ireland box this month. I don't know. It, it could be when I go on there that I just like absolutely love this and everything. Thing. Um, I think when I got this box, I was hoping for more like the last box where it really brought a piece of Ireland to me. A, um, I'm not feeling it with this box. The last one and had a very it was a very strong connection for me. This one, and I'm not feeling that. Um, I could, I, I kind of feel like I can go on any, a, you know, website and get a tour of Ireland somewhere. Or I wanted, I want something that it connects me more with it. Um, but we'll see. I haven't taken the tour yet. So, oh, I, I, I'm kind of speaking out of turn. Or, so I will have to let you know. And maybe that I end up in tears because that's where I want to be is back in Ireland. All right. That is it. That is the Ireland the my Ireland box for the month of June. Let me know what you thought of it. And then and and until I see you again, have a great day. Bye.